What's going on everyone and welcome back to Bio Mutant. Now today's quest is to show you where you can get your hands on a very, very unique backpack that allows you to fly for a short period of time called Soul's Trunk. Now if you've been playing Bio Mutant and you want to stay up to date on all of the latest guides, tips, secrets, and more, all you got to do is tap that subscribe button to receive those as they become available. Now thank you so much for being a subscriber, I honestly do appreciate you guys, and let's go ahead and get started with today's video. Okay so before we even get started, I wanted to point out that for this to work you will either need a glider for your automaton or the bat nam nam gliding mount to access this location for the automaton glider it is available from the animal that visits you periodically and causes you to fight your mirage in doing so when done you have the option to unlock the glider for your automaton if not i have a video available that details how to unlock the bat nam nam in my playlist that you can also check out but you will either need one of the two for this to work all right so bio mutant is coming up on its first week of being released and with that many players have been exploring and adventuring out looking for the best gear crafting items side quests and more come to find out side quests provide some very unique items such as one of a kind gliding mounts rare weapons and armor and more just to name a few now it just so happens that as i was exploring one of the very last locations for myself in the game i happened to stumble upon a side quest that rewards an ultimate rarity backpack called soul's trunk that literally lets you fly for an extended period of time possibly making it one of the most amazing and unique items in the game so today's video will show you how to access this area start and finish the side quest as well as show all of the area objectives at the end of the video so if you're having trouble finding those stubborn area objectives stay tuned until the end also you can unlock a new automaton appearance here so i will also show you that side quest okay so let's kick this off with showing you where exactly the location of the aerodome is if you open up your map and go all the way to the top of the map you may see an area called Cluppy Dunes as shown right here on my map. The western side of this area is actually a rundown airport called Aerodome. This location has a side quest for Soul's Trunk, an ultimate flying backpack you can wear, as well as an automaton appearance you can unlock too. Now the first apparent issue is how to access the location as there is not a direct zip line or road in it that I was able to find and the water is actually toxic so you can't just go ahead and summon your Goog Glide and then drive on over. So what I found to work is you need to make your way to a small village called Frockle, which is directly across from one of these small islands as shown right here on the map. Now once here, make your way back where the mountains are and follow as I do to get on top of them. From here you just have to glide over on your glider or bat nam nam to make your way to brick back 11j now you can stay and fight everyone and complete the area objectives or you can just run past them and make your way to the mountains all the way in the back of this island by following the road now you do have the option of climbing up this mountain if you want but you can also access the ledge that is directly beneath them and glide from here as well just as i did but it is pretty risky because it's going to be very very close to getting stuck in all that nasty goo if done correctly you'll now be able to access the aerodome location from here make your way across the zip line and into the airport staying on the left side of the airport until you make your way to the airport gates where soul will appear out of a trunk of his own simply walk up to soul and talk to him which will be a pretty lengthy conversation about books reading the world and more until he assigns a side quest called without end this quest takes you to the tower out back behind the runways but first you need to defeat the flight plus jet spur who will also give you a vault key for aerodome once defeated continue to make your way up the tower with the elevator and then there should be a zip line at the top out of one of the windows take this all the way to the plane crash site where you'll need to go in front of the plane and then pull a lever to start one of the engines that is nearby make your way to this engine jump in the air vortex that is coming out of it and then catch all of the pages that are in the air now once done you can go ahead and make your way back to soul in which there will be a ledge for you to glide from back to the aerodome Soul will give you another side quest called going places which takes you back to the first island you landed on when accessing aerodome and you can collect your soul's trunk backpack from here then go back to soul and complete the quest as i stated earlier there is also an automaton appearance you can unlock from here just as a side note the appearance of the automatons that you unlock are random as i found out by playing the side quest twice and mine were different for each time so you can always save right now and if you don't like the appearance load back up and do the side quest again and hopefully it should change either way you need to make your way back to the roads that leads away from aerodome as shown right here on the map once here there will be a sign board that you can go 
look to and interact with to start your side quest. From here, you can track that quest and follow it, but it will take you underneath Arrow Dome through a manhole or man cover that's actually nearby. Now, you need to complete the puzzle once underground to remove the water underneath, in which you will access a tunnel. And if you go to the right side of that tunnel, there's actually another location where there will be another air vortex that shoots you up in the air. On one side of this is a package containing your automaton, and the other side is a puzzle to open the door and actually get out of there. So collect your automaton by the door and you'll have completed this side quest as well. All right, so that is how to obtain the flying backpack called Soul's Trunk in Biomuin as well as a brand new automaton appearance. I do hope this guide was helpful and if so, drop a like so that way we can go ahead and share it with others. If you'd like even more Biomuin guides, tips, secrets, and more, all you gotta do is tap that subscribe button for those as I release them daily. My name is Silverback, our quest is complete, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Balance is the key. Sickening. Ah, plastic scrap like that always comes in handy. You need to line up the switches so they match. Just a few moves left. Make them count. A key for every lock. Now that's a quality weapon. for you. You need to unturn the pipe type. Really want to wash away. Seems that the knobs need to be aligned so the device can load its program. Look at the details on this one. You can always find some use for rubber scrap. You should. Who'd leave rubber scrap lying around like Someone took pr You need to line up the switches so they match. Just a few moves left. Make them count. Good. That's enough electric. That's built. You need to line up the switches so they match.